basically pre pretty much dominated by the massive window and um, I wanted having the sofa underneath it, I didn't want full length curtains but I didn't like how plain the blinds were so it was a really cheap and inexpensive way and just to add a bit more um, personality and fun just to add these pom poms to the bottom um, like that, I don't know if that helps you see them at all, no probably not because it's like really bright outside um, so I have those down there scooching you over a little bit um, I've got a bell up here and that was actually originally Brad's bell it came from his room um, and I just really liked the, how it looked and everything and then down below as you come in through the front door because that's our front door here um, we've got a bowl which I actually hand pottery painted with all the brush strokes on that we keep our keys in and some little plants as well on this Ikea tray thing and then we keep all of our shoes in that unit there scooching on round again and we've got and you can't really see very well because of all the exposure to it but we've got the wall of clipboards and things so they've got like um what we're doing like calendars and things on as well as wish lists and things like that all the sofa things well not all of them actually the throw is a Dunnell Mill teddy bear throw this cushion came from I think it was a Sainsbury's or something and then the pink fluffy one was a primer find the sofa is an Ikea sofa bed so it folds out into a sofa bed but because of how small this room is originally I wanted one of the Ikea like three seat sofas which was a corner sofa and the sofa bed but logistically it just wouldn't have fit in here so to try and combat that um, and still like get what I wanted out of it I bought a footstool and this footstool is a DFS footstool I got second hand it's actually grey in colour and it's an ottoman so it lifts up and down and um, we were going to have this rug on the floor but it never actually managed to get that put down on the floor and I actually really like the look of it on the footstool as well so by having the footstool we've got the extra storage that we would have had in the other sofa and um, it's a sofa bed anyway so it's, we still have that and it's nice just to stick your feet on and lounge about whilst watching TV or something then I just keep this little tray on here most of the time just to catch like bits and like books and things that I'm reading or my bullet journal which I am like tend to write on whilst watching TV then scooching on over we've got Brad's bookcase with all his bits in so this originally was just a normal bog standard bookcase which I have extended by adding like I don't know what the thickness is, it's about that much of wood onto the back to make the shelves longer so that his keyboard fits on. Then I added um, roll, rollers, runners to this shelf so that it runs out like a desk would um, but also folds away as well so that when he's not using it it's just nice and sort of away. He's got all of his boxes of things um, and some decorative items as well that I've just shoved in there. So we've got the a copper leaf thing, with, um, candle votive thing that I found online. Some, ooh, I don't know if I can turn them on. Ooh, some little LED copper lights that I got from Poundland last year, I think, at like Christmasy time. But I think they sell them all year round because I've seen them in there since. Um, and then it's just like his boxes of things and the candle holder thing that I made for as a Valentine's Day DIY on my channel as well as, I don't know if you can see up top, Ooh. A, another plant and some copper gold, copper gold? Just copper, um, letters in there, then moving around we have a bit of a strange thing going on 
in terms of like dresses and things because you've got this is just a normal like clothes dresser which we keep our clothes in in the living room which i know sounds a bit odd but we liked how it consistently worked with the kitchen drawers and there will be a separate video on how i styled the kitchen but we preferred how it seemed more coherent and consistent with the look of the kitchen having the um ikea drawers in here as opposed to in the bedroom and then i've got a cube unit in the bedroom and there will also be another video on the bedroom as well then we've just got our tv here which was initially meant to go on the wall hence the plug up on the wall which drives me insane quite honestly seeing that above the tv but i don't know whether we will just because of the weight of the tv and whether we trust it or not then we've got um another plant cactus thing over here xbox and things and then a few decorative items as well as i guess this is probably going to feature in both videos really but um our compost bin just tucked in behind the tv there so this is my living room it's small ish but it really does the job that we need it to and um I hope you enjoyed this video guys and please make sure to subscribe to my channel if you do like these videos check out my bathroom video that was last week's video I will try and leave it in the comments down below and I will see you guys next time bye